I think James has to be careful because he at that all point, respect, respect, we're the, here. The, the NBA doesn't need him. We're here. The NBA doesn't need him no more. So the way, and I'm all for player empowerment. All of us are for player empowerment, but we're he forces his way out of Houston, forces his way out of Brooklyn. Now he's trying to force his way out of Philly. Like at, at some point, everyone's going to be say like, and he's got so much talent and a lot of game left, could talk himself out of the league with his talent, which is crazy to think. Remember when Melo said he wasn't coming off the bench? They blackballed him for how many years? Y'all remember this? About two years? He had to go to Portland on like some fucking bullshit. Man, listen, man, that, I, man, when he went, when, they, when, when Melo went to Portland, I thought that was the biggest bullshit of the league. Mm -hmm. But it was also the league speaking to Melo. Humble yourself. Like straight up. And that humbled him too, bro. Yeah, straight up. AI, this is what they finna do to James Harden, or at least yeah. it feels like I told Peters, I ain't think that I ain't th I think that a couple times when you when you wiggle your way out, bro, you only got about what one or two wiggles? You ain't got no infinite bro. See, Especially said, when you get in, older. So infinite infinite wiggles. When you get older, that Just, that they put up with Yeah, come on, man. When you young and you hot, yeah, they, they put up with everything. They're gonna let you rock. When you old oh, and like, like, one foot out the door, it's like all right, keep acting like that. We're gonna be a lot less. And, and I, I feel deal. like we all feel like he has so much game left. You know, he's not the player he was, but he's still that 19 and 10 type guy, so he could still play. So my thing with him is he just has to be careful. As good as he is, he could the way he's been wiggling, like KG said, you only get so many wiggles. You know How what I mean? He, he ain't got that many step backs now. How did he show up to Philly though? Right. Tell Hard. me about the tell me y'all's situation showing up to Philly. What's day I mean, what's uh James Harden showing up to Philly camp. What's the expectation level? I'm not buying it because you and Maury was buddy buddy all these years. Now y'all beefing because they don't want it. Like I ain't buying it. He, he, gonna, he gonna go there and be friends again. They gonna go there and be friends again and try to make it work, but it ain't gonna work. He gonna kiss and make up? Bro, it ain't gonna work. What else they gonna do? I think he might say his back hurt. I think he gonna. I think he all the way on that. <laughs> that's the yeah. vet yeah. move. Yeah. Hey, in case y'all don't I know, think he on that's that. the vet move to sitting out. You can't, can't Pete, examine the back. When you want to sit, everybody know this. Y'all know this, if you Absolutely. want to sit out and be on the IR, you had a problem, you say your back, back. hurt, yep. because it's hard muscles. to evaluate the back. Too many muscles. Yeah, yeah, he's he's what part of the back? The lower back. Yeah. The lower. It's just hurting. I'm hurt. I can't, what I can't, you going to say to somebody it's saying tight. that? It's and tight. that's a vet move. Y'all remember the Houston James Harden, how he came in? Plus 20. He was super big. He was super plus 30 or 20, whatever Damn. he was. That turkey leg had to do it to you. <laughs> is this what we expecting? Is this what we expecting? I don't like it, because I just feel like he has so much game. You know what I mean? So I would love to see him just go out there and, and, and play basketball. But for, I mean, for his, he did take less. You know what I mean? I don't think we're talking about the part mm. where we're holding management accountable either because a lot of these motherfuckers are full of shit in management. Mm. And James took less for them to move their shit around and he was promised something was gonna happen. So naturally I get he's gonna be mad, but you can't not, you can't forget about the Houston wiggle out, the Brooklyn wiggle out, and now Philly may be playing you wrong, but you still trying to wiggle out of that. So at the end of the day, n not everyone is understanding how executives move. So the outside look perspective is this guy's just full of shit right now. Please. Nobody want to see him play basketball. We want to see him win. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like they, we tired of just seeing him dribble, dribble. Like we want to see you win, bro. Prove us that you can win. Yeah, That's game, what we at with James. We game, know you are nice. His game ain't giving me that championship type oh, yeah. vibe. No way. When no he passed way. the ball, he stayed right there in yeah. one place. Like he ain't going to screen or flare for nobody. He ain't cutting. He ain't throwing the ball in the post, cutting hard. He just passed the ball and sit there. That don't, that don't give me championship basketball. Yeah. Just to be honest, and if you see how he been closing out his last, what, four, five years, yeah. it looked like he just been quitting. It's been nasty. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, he had a, like a 40 point game against the Celtics, but when you, got that type, that, when you got that type of momentum, you probably keep that going. Despite who the man. He disappeared. You feel me? And he disappeared. So I'm not surprised that they didn't make no moves with him. I'm thinking he need to come back and really show them that yeah. I'm that dude. What's the market for him? I mean, to your point, who wants to take that Ace kind of situation Tyrone. in? Do they now, though? But Not they're the Rockets, young. the city. My young guys. <laughs> Not the Rockets, yeah, they're, they're, the city. That's my point. Do you want, want that around, around my young guys? You know what I'm saying? You want them around I think that's court? a big thing. They don't want around them young guys down yeah, there. They want him. The city want him. Because when James is in Houston, everybody making money. And I ain't saying it coming out of his pocket, no, but real. he brings everybody that's to the that's city real. of Houston. That's they want him in Houston, Houston for business purposes, not for basketball. Yeah. <laughs> he actually, he actually did uh, what Bron did for the, uh, for uh, the Cleveland's economy. economy. Mm -hmm. Man, I don't know if y'all know this, man. Y'all go down to Houston when James Hall was down there, boy. The right. goddamn mall, the goddamn strip clubs, the pop-ups, right the restaurants, the goddamn lounges. Thirteen, his restaurant. Yeah. Mm. That's Popping. what's up.